Hi, this is Scott Dudley, and in this video, we're going to take a look at how you can change the theme and layout in Looker Studio and how you can do it quickly and easily. So, for theme and layout, the quickest way to get there is just to click on the top up here theme and layout. Now, it naturally gives you these different options here to select a palette. But these are a little bit limited, but I mean, if we just click through these and have a look, there's a few different options it gives you here. Now, obviously, it's not going to change the red bars at the top of these uh, tables here. They'll, they'll have to be changed manually, but that's pretty easy to do. However, if you don't like any of the options that they give you here, what you can do is at the very bottom, there's an option here to extract theme from an image. And this is highly useful for saving time and making things look pretty much exactly how you want them to look. So you click on exact, sorry, extract theme from image. And then you've, you're given two options here, either by URL or to upload from computer. So if you already have an image on your computer that contains the colors that you'd like to use, then you can just upload that. Or you can use a URL on the web, which I'm going to do in this particular case. So we'll click on buy URL. And let's just say, for example, not that I like these colors here or I'd ever consider using them, but let's just say, for example, that you wanted to use the colors that are contained in this image here. Now, I know obviously you could get a better image than this, but I've just done a quick check on the web and this is one of the first things that I've come across um, that's got like a, a themed image to it. So, to add this, obviously we're just going to come up to the top here into the URL and we're going to copy the URL and then come back into Looker Studio and then paste in that URL where it's got upload image by URL. We click on upload. Let's give it a second to load. And then it's given us three options here, which you'll notice sort of match the purple colors that it's got in, in this image. So you can either choose one with the dark background, the light background, I mean, these first two here, they look exactly the same to me. I don't think there's any difference in those whatsoever. But let's just say we wanted to choose this option here on the right-hand side with the black background. So we'd need to click on it and then click Apply. And then you'll notice that it's applied those settings to, to this page. You probably can't really notice it that well, but you can see here that the button has changed to purple, the background has changed to black. Uh, and if you're not happy with that, then obviously you can upload a different image or you can come in here and choose something completely different. But it's just a much quicker way of doing it rather than trying to set like the background manually and then set the button colors manually. If you can just upload an image that has your brand colors on it, for example, or your logo, then it will quickly give you some options to choose from that match your brand logo, which is uh, excellent for saving time and getting the right colors uh, on your Looker Studio reports. So anyway, hopefully you got some value out of that. If you've got any more suggestions for videos that I should create, just let me know in the comments. Thanks.